Hi, this is Ian from Scott Country. I, I'm in the service department and today I'm showing you how to update your Axian key. A uh, couple of things you will require is the Axian key itself, um, the USB cable that it's supplied with, and you will need a PC computer. Um, as the Axian key doesn't have the Wi-Fi video functions that the other Axians have, you have to do the update manually and cannot be done via mobile device. To help with the Axian update system, um, we've actually got everything you need onto a nice newsletter, which is available in our latest news section on the website. This web page goes through all the things that you will need, plus um, a step-by-step -step guide of what to do. First thing is you will need to download the Axian key software to update the application. You can find this either on our website or on Pulsars. You just click the link and once you've done that, it will open a driver here. Double click on this driver. If you're using uh, Windows 8 or Windows 10, it might block the driver being installed. All you need to do is click more information and run anyway. Once this has happened, You'll get an icon on your computer, which is update Axiom key. Make sure that the Axiom's got a fully charged battery and is turned on. And what to do is plug it in using the USB lead. When you plug the Axiom in and it's connected successfully, you will hear that noise. Now, Make sure the Axiom's turned on, and once it's turned on and connected in, you follow the on-screen instructions, which will say OK. It will say, your device is ready to start the update process. Click, click OK. Important information, do not disconnect the device during the update. Press OK, and it will start the update for you. You'll get a percentage bar on your screen, and you'll also get a bar in the Axiom. And once it's done, you'll get a notification. The update has been successful. You select OK. It's then going to tell you when you can disconnect the device. So now that the device is fully updated, you can then disconnect the device by pulling out USB lead. And that's your Axiom updated. If your Axiom for some reason is on the latest firmware, you will get a notification saying that and you don't need to go through the firmware process. Thank you very much for watching the video. If you've got any questions, uh, just give us a call on 01 556 50 3587.